Boom. Peace. Intro. What's up? What's everyone doing? Got me a package in from our buddy Fern C. I think I told y'all one was coming. Feels a little heavier. Oh, I think I remember two things he said he was sending. That's right. <clears throat> anyway, um, hold on a second. Sorry, guys. Had to grab something real quick over there. I forgot. Andre Cruz said on well, my last couple videos ago, um, Rambo wanted his knife back. I was like, that's not a knife, buddy. I'll show you a knife. I happen to collect knives as well. I collect firearms, knives. I collect a lot of stuff. But anyway, <clears throat> there's a nice little beauty for you. This is just one of my favorites. I have lots of them. Look at that beauty. Now, as Crocodile Dundee would say, this is a knife. This is actually a Gil Hibben. It's actually a very nice big blade. She's a she's a nice little hatcher. She'll she'll chop you up real good or chop up some something or another. But anyway, yeah, look at that baby. Woo! Just to give you a little bit of a reference there. Well, I guess that's about the size of the handle. <laughs> Yeah, that's just one. I have tons of them. I actually have these all over the house. They come pretty sharp too. I had one, I pulled it out and just sliced almost clean through one of my sheaths a while back. And uh, but yeah, I keep these all over the place too. You never know, never know, never know. But they these are for not for cutting open boxes. They're they're for um how do we say they're for meat. They're for cutting meat. So you need to keep them keep them sharp. But anyway, buddy, that's a knife. These and the other those are just letter openers. Also, check this out, guys. I ran out this morning. I had to take a couple packages to the post office. Mr. Irredeemable, I finally got yours sent off. Um, I may find some more stuff for you later, but I sent off what I had now because it was just sitting there building up. And uh, I sent off what I had for you, Mike Dyson. Um, I did throw one of the Batmobiles in there. I had one left. And uh, I didn't have all that other stuff he was asking for. Or, um, well, you didn't really ask for it. You just put it on a list so I'd know. I did have a couple, two or three of them. So I threw them in the box. And uh, I mailed it off, so keep your eye out. I sent both of you tracking numbers. So, anyway. After that, me and my grandson swung by Target just to see if they had anything. Nothing. Nothing again. Same. Th I've been watching all your videos. And uh, everybody's having the same thing. Target is just blank. I have no idea what's going on. Just blank. I went to Walmart yesterday. They had a massive dump bin, all like PK, some QK, stuff I've already gotten. And uh, I grabbed a couple more things here and there, mainly because people wanted them and uh, got those. And uh, that was it. And then yesterday I went ahead and swung by there. And after I left Target, I went right across the street to Walmart and check it out. Scored the brand new Boulevard set. That's perfect timing because it would have been gone instantly. Grabbed two sets. The whole box. Just put them out. Took them all. Every one of them. One for me. One for my amigo. Should he want them. If he doesn't, I'm sure somebody else will. But yeah, check them out. Pretty sweet. I get all of them, so I had to get it. Toyota 4Runner. Sweet. 
This one's really nice. 97 Mercedes Benz. Check that baby out. Woo! I'm not much on silver. Could have been a different color. I think yellow would have looked hot. Yellow would have looked awesome. But it's cool. And this one, the Volkswagen Caper Racer. Oh, uh, our buddy uh, Alex Graff, or, or uh, Mini-Me, you'd like that. Look at that, buddy. Pretty sweet, huh? Pretty nice. Then the uh, Nissan Hard Body. Lowered. She slammed. Look at that. Pretty cool, huh? And then the Honda Civic EG custom version, which my hunting amigo is definitely going to want that, but I don't want to break up the set. So hopefully he wants the whole set. Because I don't want to just sell him or give him or trade or do anything to anybody just one of the cars out of the set. You know what I mean? Um, I, I'd rather give the whole set. Now, if I had a broken up set, that would be fine. But we'll see. We'll see what he wants. He may, I don't know. But anyway, there's the Honda Civic. And uh, that's it. That's all I found there. Um, my grandson grabbed a couple. Uh cars but actually uh, I didn't say anything to him I let him go ahead and just get them but I had them I could have just let him have mine but I think he knows I had them I think he just wanted to get them from the store so he did he got the red GTO convertible series which I have one yeah, and um, and he got uh, something else I don't remember oh and uh, I sent that Forza set to Mr. Deemable. He said he wanted it, so I, I, he, he, would, he wouldn't mind having it. He didn't ask me for any of that stuff. And so I sent it to him. So I no longer have that. And uh, um, he didn't actually say anything about the, 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 car culture two pack so I I, I, don't, I didn't send it um, so uh, most likely since Fern C said something in the comments about that is the only one he's missing and he would like to have it most likely I'll probably send it to him and uh, I mean it helps complete a set guys I mean um, so I think that's probably what will happen to that one. So anyway, and then, real quick, I'll show you something. I've already had two people now. The first guy set the precedent for that Jeep I made, the, the yellow one. Contacted me, wanted one, and 100 bucks for the thing. And I think that's fairly good. I mean, I think that's a fair price. I'm glad he offered that much. Um, he's a really good guy, so... He probably could have got it from me a little cheaper because it's him. But really, 100 bucks is what it should be. Well, after that, somebody else got a hold of me and wanted one as well. And I, I told them the same price, 100 bucks. And uh, so they want it. So I got two of them. I'm already mocking up. I'm actually mocking up three because I'm making an extra because somebody else may want one as well. But I know somebody may th some people may think that takes too much. I got... Um, the other one I've already got the cage built for. And uh, that's what you got to do for You got to get them mocked up before you can do anything. I got to build the cage for the other two. And uh, I'm only showing them now because uh, uh, you already seen the, the final result. And uh, But those are going to take a while, guys, because I got other people's customs I'm working on at the same time. So... But I can't just move you guys ahead of everybody. I mean, I got other people I'm giving cars to. 
that I already said I'm going to make one for. I need to finish theirs. Um, one is a... Uh, um, <clears throat> well, there's several of them, actually. But, um, you know, Rut Ledge, um, his, he's a giveaway. I got his over there. Got to do decals and clear it. Um, but I, you know, I got to finish, I got to finish these guys' cars, guys. I can't just, I mean, I hope that doesn't sound terrible, but I can't just shove you guys ahead of everybody else because, you know, you're, you're paying me. Um, but I work on them in between. Like when I'm waiting for this, something on this one, then I'll, I'll mess with these others. So I'll be building the cages for the other two of those Jeeps, um, after I get some other things done here, because I got some other things to do. But thanks guys for buying those, and uh, I appreciate the fair price. Some of you guys may think $100 is way too much for that Jeep, but man, I don't think you have any idea what it takes to build that. And I haven't sent it off yet, because I'm waiting for it to cure a little more. So hopefully it doesn't come apart, because he wanted me to... Uh, kind of crazy he actually you know mr jeffries he actually contacted me and said please don't even send it if you think it's going to come apart well i can't do that buddy i gotta send it to you i mean it's yours hopefully it won't come apart i'm gonna do my best to keep it from coming apart but if it does hopefully you can fix it if it's if it's too messed up then you can send it back to me and i'll fix it but i just i'm letting it cure a little longer trying to do the best I can to make sure it doesn't come apart. But anyway, guys, you wouldn't, there's a lot of work in that. Um, I'm going to have to agree with some people when they say that it's worth a hundred dollars because it is worth a hundred dollars. I mean, I, it is to me anyway. So thank you guys for that. And like I said, I'm building an extra one just in case. Um, so I will have an extra one. If somebody wants that one, I'll already have it built. And, uh, but if they don't, then I'll have one for myself. <laughs> See how that works? So anyway, thanks again, guys. Just thought I'd give you an update on that. And looks like he sent me... Actually, it seems like there's more in here than I was anticipating. Let me see. Oh, I hope he didn't send something I was supposed to send to somebody else because I already sent that off. Uh-oh. I wonder if he knows I already sent that off. I sh shoot. I didn't know. I hope he didn't do that. <clears throat> okay. Oh, all right. Got got a couple Illinois plates. Like uh, y'all remember I got one from Pennsylvania from Mr. Andre Cruz. And again, guys, I cannot believe how many of you guys live in Pennsylvania. I'm not gonna say all of you guys but i ain't gonna say your names but i had mentioned to one of our you know to one person that man i wish i'd have known i'd have tried to come down there and then uh you know they suggested well you could fly in well i i i was like yeah well i don't fly i don't fly guys never i mean when i was a baby i guess my mom flew me from rhode island to california i don't know about it but I don't fly. I don't trust any of those things. I worked, well, God, man, I've done, I've worked everywhere, guys. You guys have no idea what I've done since I was 12. I have been all over the place. But anyway, I worked by a, an old, it was a, it was a service that delivered parts to a Boeing company. And you would not believe how old and dangerous a lot of these planes are that you're flying in that you have you have no idea how old and out of date i mean they oh my god i don't even want to scare you guys so i'm not going to go into details but you would be shocked to know just how dangerous those things are um i, I admit they do a lot of technology updating to try to you know make things better than they were 30 years ago but i just don't trust them so anyway I, um, I thought, because I drive everywhere. I just drive. California, wherever I drive. Um, Texas. Well, I looked up there. Man, that's 16 hours, a little more than 16 hours for me. I was like, whoa. 
I didn't I didn't realize that, that that you guys were so far away from me, man. So guess what, Andre? Don't look like you're gonna be just jumping in that explorer and heading this way anytime soon, huh? Ain't that right? <laughs> well, I guess you could. I guess you could. Anyway, by the way, that last video you put out, that intro with all the pictures, <laughs> that, that, that got me all misty-eyed, man. That was real. That was real. I mean, come on, stop it, dude. You're just tearing me up over here. Anyway, I got some Illinois plates. Pretty cool. Appreciate that, Fern. Oh, all right. All right. Sent me the... Uh, and I don't see a note, so I don't know if I was supposed to do something with any of these. But he sent me some uh, more of the estate. Thank you, buddy. I had those. Man, I hope I'm... I hope there, maybe there's a note in here telling me what I'm supposed to do with those. Maybe I was supposed to add those to a package or something. The Aston Martin Valhalla. Man, I wonder. I wonder if. I wonder if I got the wrong package. I don't think this is my package, guys. Ruh row. No way. This ain't my package, guys. I'm not going to go any further. I'm putting all this back in here and getting a hold of fern. I do not believe this is my package at all. Um, yeah, no. Let me make sure I got everything back in there. I'm not pulling that rest of that stuff out, guys. That is not what I was expecting from him. No wonder it felt so heavy. Um, I'm going to post this video. Maybe he'll see it and contact me, but I'm going to send him a text anyway. Sorry, guys. I'm not going any further. That is not my package. I'm almost positive he knows I have those cars. He would not have sent me those cars. Um, I think he meant to send that to somebody else, so that means that the somebody else has probably got my package. He's probably not going to be a happy camper. Um, anyway, guys, sorry about that. Um, well, at least you saw these, you know, and, uh, again, thanks guys for ordering up those Jeeps. I appreciate that. And I appreciate you being fair about the price. At least I think it's fair. There's a lot of work involved in those things and I do try to make them nice. And, um, like I said, I'll have one extra cause I'm making it just in case, you know, what's crazy is a lot of times I make two or three or something and just in case somebody wants it. And, um, it works out. But this one, I was like, you know, I'm making one to give away. I haven't ever really had anybody ask for one. I mean, I made that big van I had back there. So I was like, yeah, nobody's going to want that. And now people wanted it. So I was like, man, I should have made two or three of them. But anyway, it's cool. I'll get those made for you guys, you two, and have them shipped out. And then I'll have the one extra in case somebody wants it. And I'm making them all identical um, because they wanted the same. I do have, I wanted to do one in a highway patrol, but I haven't got to that yet. Um, that may be later on. Um, but uh, anyway, now you guys know. So there, there'll be an extra one of those just in case anybody wants it. And, um, but like I said, if not, it'll be one for me. <laughs> so appreciate it, guys. I better let you go and um, contact our buddy Fern. Because I believe I have the wrong package. Peace. Outro.